and go hide away from the light. But I don't dare to, I'm too fragile, and for that I do apologize. Maybe someday we can work it out, but I'm afraid it's too late to try. Baby, I don't dare to love you, and you know the reason why. Don't you know I'm way too weak to swim? Can't you feel the waves come crashing in? Running out of safety nets, cause every night, every night, I fall down in the middle of the night, screaming, oh my God, cause you love to be, you know you love to be. I reach out in the middle of the night, screaming, oh my, my, cause you love to be, you know you love to be. And it feels wrong, but I'm not afraid to admit I used to feel safe next to you, babe Now I'm thinking I deserve a hit Maybe someday we could work it out But I'm afraid it's too late to try Baby, I don't dare to love you And you know the reason why Don't you know I'm way too weak to swim? Can't you feel the waves come crashing in? Running out of safety nets Cause every night, every night I fall down in the middle of the night Screaming, oh my God Cause you love too deep You know you love too deep I reach out in the middle of the night Screaming, oh my, my Cause you love too deep You know you love too deep hey. Hey you guys, what's up my love muffins? It's your girl and today's video is going to be a lace frontal tutorial with China Lace Wigs. So I've worked with this company a zillion times prior to this video and they do have some really nice quality wigs. So the first thing that you see me doing in this particular video is I'm using my hot comb because girl I need to make sure that the lace is melted to the hairline. I would normally do this on myself for a hair tutorial, but y'all see that little white spot in the middle of my forehead by the hairline almost. That's from doing a tutorial and showing you guys how to lay something when in fact the only thing that was getting laid was my skin with the hot comb or the curling wand. So I decided for my skin's sake that I would just show you guys on the mannequin. If you don't have a mannequin, canvas block mannequin, I would highly suggest, recommend that you do get one. Now this part right here, as you see where I'm pointing to, is the lace that is overlapping my ear, as you guys can see. Now back in the day, I would have never did this method because I just wouldn't have. But now I do it all the time, which is I create a part and then I cut right into that part, leaving the ear space free and the wig sitting flush to my head. And then I do that on the opposite side parting right above my ear, taking my scissors and cutting into the lace where the part is at, removing it and allowing my ear to breathe and to rest and the wig to rest flat and flush up against my head. Now this step is definitely not an option, it's a must, which is removing the lace from your unit. You definitely gonna wanna do this girl because if you don't, then everybody's gonna know you got a wig on. And I don't know about y'all, but I know wigs are trending, they're in, they're popping, but I try to, to really try to conceal that it's a wig. Like I don't care if you think that's what you think, but knowing and thinking are two different things. So I'd rather you think I got on a wig than know. You get what I'm saying? You get the dress, right? So this part right here is me taking my rat tail comb and parting along the hairline. I do this because for one, I like to spray hairspray in between the part and underneath, like so underneath and then you'll see me in a few minutes do on top of but as you see where i'm pressing down where that comb is at that tip of that comb i will definitely spray hairspray in between the part as you see right here in between the part and underneath this will definitely allow your wig to sit strong and sturdy girl this way they won't know they just be thinking it's a wig but thinking and knowing is two different things okay so now i'm just going to press into that lace as i blow dry it having a blow dryer is really important 
I say if you don't have one, then spray in small sections. But girl, you can find you a nice little blow dryer for five dollars if you go to like Family Dollar. Try to get you a cheap blow dryer. It's really beneficial. It doesn't have to be a robotic one. It can be something for like five dollars. Trust me, it may only last a year, but at least you got a year's worth out of five or ten dollar blow dryer. Then versus nothing at all. Okay. So now I just take those hairs that you see me pull forward. I did create somewhat of a baby hair swoopage wispy type of thing going here. Now my sideburn hairs at the bottom by the ear, those are my ear tab hairs, sideburn hairs. I need them. But I also do like to play around a little bit with the baby hairs, the wispy hairs. So as you see, I'm just finessing them. I don't need a whole head full. You know what I'm saying? But in particular spots, where I may feel that you know I got on a wig, that's when I camouflage it to where you gotta think. Oh, I think she might got on a wig. I'd rather you think than know. Meaning, knowing is definitely seeing. And seeing is believing, honey. And I'd rather it all be an illusion to you and feel like you think I got on a wig. Now, China Lace wig has been around for quite some time. And I know I'm late on this, but girl, they got a nice sale going on. And who don't love a good sale where you can get some good quality wigs for a fraction of the price. So y'all head on over to ChinaLaceWig.com and check out what they got. Plus they done went ahead and changed their whole setup like, you know, their entire, um, what do you call, je ne sais quoi. Okay. So just check them out. They got some really nice wigs on there. Plus their mannequin heads are cute too. And like I said, I've been working with them for some time. So their quality has definitely changed. Now this lace on this wig is called the High Quality HD Japanese Lace. Now honey, I never heard of such, but you know, all of these different type of wigs that are coming out, all these different type of lace that's coming out, it's amazing that the natural and the realistic look that you can get out of these wigs. Just like this right here, thinking is not the same thing as knowing. Now, I know for a fact that this wig is bomb as hell. It came out beautiful. 190% density, 18 inches. And the colors, honey, is beautiful. I really do like what they sent me. And I will say this. I did bleach the knots and pre-puck a tad bit, but I definitely did bleach it. And I will say it was definitely worth all the rave for this wig. So, you guys, check the info description box down below. I will definitely leave some info down there for you guys so you can check out China Lace Wigs and this one right here. Let me know what you think. How did I do, boo? I love you all. Make sure you rate, comment, subscribe, thumbs the video up, and I will definitely see y'all in the next one. Bye.